So I went to cancel my EA Play membership and EA spammed me with a bunch of emails saying, hey, we, we got good games on here. We got Anthem. Don't don't cancel your membership. Play Anthem. Anthem's good. So here I am playing Anthem to see if Anthem is good. We are freelancers. Freelancer is not a good name for the guys to be. Freelancer sounds like I'm going to get a quest to redesign the website for a local coffee shop and then they'll refuse to pay me. Red barrel time. Here we go. Not bad, Anthem. Activate your ultimate ability with D-pad. If you don't think that's cool, you're just a hater. Anthem sucks, but that was good. How'd he get hit by that? Just go up. He could have moved in any direction to avoid that. He's gone. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. That guy sucks. Oh, there goes that one too. That one's also dead. These jetpack guys suck. We lost more than freelancers. More than friends and comrades. We lost two robot suits. We lost the faith of the people we protect. Oh, that too. So just two guys die and everyone's like, well, the jetpack robots aren't good anymore. Press left stick while jumping to fly. There we go. Now we're playing Anthem. Oh yeah. Come here, alien. I want to kill you. I want you to die. You do know you probably just orphaned some baby rabbits there. I don't care, funny British robot. In a world where you can jetpack around the waterfall, stay inside of the green circle. Don't move. After a job well done, I like to relax at Maz Kanata's bar on Takadona. Did you see the Mandalorian flag there? Top 10 Easter eggs you missed. Huh, the hub town is in first person and you move really slow. Why don't I have the robot suit in the hub town? Why do I gotta crawl around like a snail between various vendors? I thought this guy was gonna be a robot AI. I didn't know he was a real person. How do I skip to Vermeer so I can choose to leave this guy behind? Javelin unlocked. Tassin has given you resources to replace your old Javelin. Choose carefully. You'll be using this suit until new Javelin classes become available at level eight. I love it when games say, choose your play style. You have to use this for the whole game. And no, you may not demo them first. You can be a cape guy. You can be the normal guy. You can be a big robot or you can be a slim robot the only real choice is the big robot obviously which color robot do you like the red robot the red robot again the red robot again should i go with mass effect because if i go with mass effect i'll just be sad that this game got made instead of mass effect but you know mass effect's cool i'll use the n7 arm why not i gotta buy it with thirty-six thousand coins i don't get it for free because i owed mass effect come on ea how does the big robot feel is he different the flying feels mostly the same but the ground combat's on a whole nother level watch and learn as i crash and burn when playing as the big robot you have to talk like this at all times that's part of the deal of being a big tank guy there it is hyrule field used to be a nice town now all that remains is guardian robots and pensive piano notes. If you listen closely, you can hear them fluttering in the breeze. Does a bulletproof robot armor suit really need a bulletproof shield ability? I feel like if the armor isn't covering the bulletproof part, then perhaps it needs to be redesigned. It's kind of the whole point of an armor suit. Oh, you can punch him with the shield. There we go. Okay. Again, though, I feel like a robot fist could accomplish that. In a world where bullets go through armor, but not shields that are way less thick than the armor. Oh, look, a castle. Wow. Humanity rarely lives in one crappy town. We abandon the castle. How is the castle not a good place to set up shop? It's a castle. It's got a gate. Look, there's a gate right there. You can just close the gate and the aliens can't get in. If I'm ever in the apocalypse, you won't catch me living in the very small claustrophobic mission hub. I'm going to go to like a Walmart and board up the windows and just live in Walmart. That's what we across the pond like the call the american dream you have looted the constrictor you have looted the hammerhead you have looted the vengeance all three of those guns look exactly the same they're all just squares oh boy i'm level four halfway there to being able to use all the robot suits will i be able to last that long though look at that robot i want to be that robot do you sell that robot can i have him war chest colossus oh it's chests it's a loot crate, yes. How do I buy one with real money? So there's minor crystals, there's major crystals, and also there's a coin currency, and there's a purple triangle currency. You got all that? You'll need to master them all if you hope to purchase the epic chilled forest wrap for your green guy. Freemark was one of the great cities of Bastion. Wait, the kids just play in the street while the Adats walk around? How many civilians are lost to the Adats stepping on them per day? Back then, what were you doing alone in Pontaix? Who cares what he's doing in Pontaix anyway? I don't care. I still have to level up like four more times before I can use the other suits. I just want to fly around in a variety of ways. Is that too much to ask? Oh, this is like a hub. There's players here. Hello. Hello, HLZDD and Iconic Legend. These are the only other two people playing Anthem. We got to squad up and go fight the Dominion. 
We can't with the Dominion get the relic. New mission, contract, protection duty. Doesn't that just sound like a good time? They could have at least spiced up the name a little bit. They could have called it like, watch out for the space spiders. Don't worry, guys. I'm here to defend you. Look out. There's a scar scrapper. Thanks for saving us, Anthem. Yeah, we owe you big time. No problem, guys. But there's more workers over there that need me to do the same thing five more times. Oh, hell, Anthem. It sure is good to see you. These guys are really dug in and they've been giving us hell. Now that you're here, we can push them back. Copy that, Sarge. Drinks are on me when we get back. Anthem would be better if instead of a jetpack guy, you played as Duke Nukem. Scar Scrapper. More like Scar Crapper. Get it? Because they fight like What the Did my dialogue just get censored? What is this, a baby game rated T for teen? Let's be real, you know a shooter is gonna suck when it's rated T. If you're making a game about blowing a guy's head off, but you also want to make it mass market enough that like a mom will buy it for a five-year-old, then that game's gonna suck. Killing stuff with a gun should be M-rated at pretty much all times. If you have a game where shooting a human in the head does extra damage, and your game does not at least have as much blood and violence as Kill Bill Volume 1, then your game is just not fun. Oh look, it's the space spiders. I knew there'd be space spiders. It took like four hours for the space spiders to show up. That's kind of crazy. Oh, you know they got the big postal. You know they pop one shot. Oh, and the goo is green. Oh man, don't get corroded. Corrosion! The Sentinel Watchtower also acted as a barracks and a Strider checkpoint. Striders would unload supplies for Vilathra at the garrison to avoid setting off the nearby ring gate and causing any accidental harm to Vilathra itself. Another delicious serving of proper noun stew. I don't know what's going on in this game, but a lot of words are capitalized, so I think it's important. Harvest, the chimeric compound. I'm compounding, I'm compounding. My interest in Anthem is not compounding, if you see what I'm saying. Oh, daily challenge complete. There we go. I'm really getting into Anthem now. Anthem is my new game. Anthem is the only game I'm going to play for like three months. Unsubscribe now, because it's going to get real bad. The top 10 builds in Anthem. Anthem. Three Five things you about Anthem. Anthem. The weekly store refresh. At long last, I face down one of the giant guys. Humanity had no chance to kill the rock guy who did AoE attacks because since he's like a multiplayer enemy, he can't really target one person very effectively. So he just does AOEs and hope somebody gets hit and usually they don't, because they just fly right over him. Falcon, punch. All you gotta do is punch him. He's not that hard to kill. And by killing that guy, I should be level eight. And once you're level eight, you can actually try out a different suit. Out of the way, wolf. No one stops me from trying on a new costume. Get moving on the repairs. What do you mean get moving? It's not done. Defend Strider. Oh my God, it never ends. I'm defending that thing right there from this guy. What is this guy gonna do? He's just a little guy. Uh-oh, it's the Urix. Can I literally just go up there and stand here and he can't hurt me? I think I can. Sorry, space gorilla, you can't hurt me. I climbed way up high with my jetpack. You can't do any damage. If it's any consolation, I have to shoot you for like five minutes to kill you. That kind of counts as a win for you, I guess. Oh, he hit me with the rock. Oh my God, he actually hit me. Look how much damage it did. Oh no, oh no, he got me again. This is a fearsome foe. I'll be lucky to walk out of this battle alive. Let me use the new mech suit Ursix. I just want to try the new jetpack for once in my life. Can you please die? There we go. Activate forge. New javelin unlocked. Oh yeah. Wait, what, is, what does it mean one unlocks? I only unlock one guy. I don't get access to all the guys. That counter better not tick down. I'm going to hit A on interceptor and it went to zero. Oh my God. This game has approximately zero variety. Why would you hide the only variety you have? That being the robot suits behind like 40 hours of grinding. Okay, a new suit. The new suit better be cool. Took me six hours to get this stupid suit. Okay, the jump is good. The jump is pretty cool. And the flying is also pretty cool. At least this thing looks pretty cool when you jump off the cliff and fly around. Anthem review. Anthem is the video game equivalent to white noise. Anthem is like gum that loses all its flavor within one minute, but then you look at the box and the box said flavorless gum. So joke's on you for even chewing it in the first place. That's the experience of playing Anthem. <laughs>